going on legends? It's time for the vlog. Let's get into it. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel again today. So I just want to give you guys a weekly vlog and let you know what's uh, going on and what's coming up on the channel. Um, so, start of the week, I had a meeting with the, uh, the engineer that I'm working with on this new trailer. So, we were uh, going over a lot of things and um, some more information I need to get him, more measurements, um, some more detailed drawings, and things like that. And then we can kind of start, he can start rendering everything up. Um, I tried to video it for you guys, but it was kind of hard this first meeting because we were... For me to try and picture, sorry, for me to try and get in his head what I wanted, I kind of had to go into that sort of depth with him um, about what was what, what I was trying to achieve. And so uh, the the first one, there won't be a video up of that, guys, because it was just it was it was too full on, and they kind of would have given everything away. What's happening with the trailer, and I kind of want to keep it under wraps for now. So the next video should be fine to. Um, next meeting with him I should be able to record more of that because we can kind of just um just have me and him talking and, and going over a few things and try not release too many details about the trailer um so that's that um I had a phone call from snug top today um apparently the container's landed um in their in their yard it's at their warehouse it's just been uh, fumigated or something they said so it's um it's due to be opened tomorrow and then they'll have my canopy out on Monday praying that it's in the uh, bloody container so so that's that um, what else has been happening oh computer so everything that I've filmed guys everything that's on my channel has all been through my um my phone so all the videos all the editing everything has been done through my phone um and it's kind of it's just getting too hard now because i can't get music through my phone to put it on the videos i need to do it on a computer or a, an ipad pro or um something like that so I want to try and release better content and more content like the Ranger Raptor off-road video. I want to do more of that stuff because I really enjoy that. Um, but it's just, it's really hard trying to do it on a phone, then find good music to match it and stuff like that. And, and I'm having rendering issues with the phone um, at the end of the videos and, and it's just, it's really getting frustrating. So I've uh, bit the bullet and I'm going to have to go and get a, um, a new computer. Um, I want to get a new camera because everything's been filmed on my phone, the GoPro or the uh, Mavic drone that I have. Um, that's how I've been filming everything. And a, a DJI Osmo is what I use with the phone as well for the, the smoother shots. No joke, I went to bloody Harvey Norman the other day. <laughs> they wanted 10 grand for a computer. Like, and I was like... You want 10 grand for a computer. 10. They're like, yeah, to do all that sort of stuff you want to do, your rendering and everything. And I was like, nah, come off it. Anyway, let me know what you guys are using to do some of your videos. And I'll, um, yeah, even tag, put some of your videos in the uh, the comments so I can check them out. Um, some of the editing and stuff you guys have done. It'd be really cool. So, I, I don't know. I'm so, I'm just... I know I want at least kind of like 16, 32 gig of RAM, um, Intel 7 at least, and all this sort of stuff, but it needs a good graphics card or whatever, and I don't know, I don't know, I don't know too much about computers, so I'm just, I get a bit flabbergasted when I try and talk about computers and shit, but um, yeah, I just needed to render fast on the rest of it, but I really need an iPad, and I was just wondering if the iPad Pro, I've seen a few, but... I just hated how Mac, like, lock your shit up on you. Like, you can't fucking export and you can't import and you can, but it's just a pain in the ass. You can't put things in folders and it just shits you. Like, Apple, get your shit together. That's why I was leading towards the, uh, I think it's a studio 
two or some some crap so maybe that and then there's like another uh, 32 gig studio big screen it's like a desktop it's not the portable version but it's like it's like seven green and i'm like holy crap i should go into making computers freaking people making a killing anyway drop a comment below let me know what you guys use um to do your rendering and stuff if any of you guys have the microsoft 2 or whatever i just want something that i can use um uh, a pencil with to do like renderings for the the van and stuff so and our future projects so i can um draw straight on the on the computer um so yeah just need a lot of capacity in that for that so. but it also needs to be able to do videos don't forget that it's got to be able to do videos do this rendering and everything so um yeah remember that so let me know so with the uh canopy once i get that fitted then i can um go and get the uh rhino rack backbone fitted to the top of it um and get the rails put on the top so can do that and then i've got to save up a bit a bit more so it'll be a couple of months away till i get the uh the bush company rooftop tent um but i think i might want to drive up and see dean um and get him to fit it up there i think that'd be a cool drive um also get him to refit the uh the awning 270 degree awning to the side of the tent so that way when i take the tent off the awning comes with it i think if uh, i go up and see dean it'd be a bit more content for you guys on the channel um i can get it fitted up properly to what what he recommends for that tent where it should sit and everything um those tents aren't cheap those tents are like three thousand nine hundred and something so they're, nearly, they're like four grand um they're badass but they look badass the, the green canvas and everything and um yeah so I'm, I'm so excited i can't wait to get that so and also the video is coming up on the channel so we've got um polaris ranger 1000 versus polaris general 1000 that's a video i'd like to do this weekend um because we've got both back at home now and um yeah give you guys a look at that because um they're both serious uh, contenders for if I was to buy another one, which one would I buy again? Whether I would go the General again or buy the Ranger. So I'm just going to give you guys a, um, a heads up on that. And um, yeah, also get your guys feedback on what you guys think is better, the Ranger or the General. Uh, so the Raptor. So we've got um, some 25mm billet spaces to fit to the front of that bad girl. Um, just to level up the front. I don't want to change the suspension and the spring settings and all that sort of stuff to try and raise the front. I had spaces in my last Ranger and everyone kind of raves on that they're dodgy and all the rest of it. They're, they're not dodgy. They they do the job. They lift it up that that much because of the sag that you would have that you would have gotten from when you drove it out of the showroom. They do settle after a little bit and um, yeah, we want to lift that front back up. So that's a video that's going to be coming. Um, and heaps more to come on the channel guys i've got so many things in the pipeline that i want to do um off-road wise so if you like off-road stuff you like f-250s you like overlanding camping all that good stuff make sure you subscribe like this video and uh yeah get on it so all right guys i will hopefully see you guys on sunday night after i do the next video Right, I hope you're all having a cracker Thursday and I'll uh, catch you on the next one. See you guys. Damn, girl, you're looking fine. Yeah, Dozer.